Hey, Flame here, and welcome back to another reaction video. Today, we're reacting to somebody new. We're reacting to Young Young Tales, Y-O-N-G, Young. Uh, reacting to, I attempted a blind Pokemon Ultra Sun, the best version, Nuzlocke. And uh, yes, um, this person obviously had another, they did another video about doing the very first Nuzlocke, I'm pretty sure overall. It was about uh, Sword and Shield. And for those like, oh, if you go to react to this one, react to that one. I've seen that when it first came out. So yes, I don't know why I didn't react to that. I should have I should have reacted to it, but I didn't. I don't know why. It was kind of, it was late at night when that came out. I love Pokemon. Pokemon is a top tier game. And uh, Ultra Sun, I, I, I bought both Ultra games. So, but my main one was Sun. Sun is my main game. I wonder if he's gonna do another bug lock. After attempting Let's my first Nuzlocke-ish thing and winning like a total boss, I decided it was time yeah. to take a vacation. And what better place vacation. than the Alolan? Ah, uh, get it. The I've never paradise. Been, and it sounds like a great time. So I packed my things, kissed my Galarian Pokemon goodbye, and took the next quail down. Goodbye, stress and death, and Alola I hope, to rest and relax. I hope Yong chose the best no, Gen 7 starter. You will Which is lit team, and if you, will you disagree, you have first I can't. It's another another baby. Baby. Now, go if you chose Rowlet, that's start. acceptable. If you chose Poppyo, that's <laughs> disgusting. No, 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 no. There is no Garbage. way I'm going to subject myself to that again. You'll get a chance to very Please don't tell me he chose a Poppyo. No, no, no. That's interesting. Okay, fine, but I'm not taking the seal. Let's go, Dwooble. Yes! That, okay, no Poppyo. We're Pokemon good. Ultra Moon Nuzlocke began. What's that? You don't know what a Nuzlocke is and you need Ultra to explain moon, it? But you wrote well, that's the impossible. sun. Anyways, Route 1 was chocked full of uh, bug Pokemon. So already my team was looking pretty good. Grubbin? We got Dwoople, the yes. Rolette, Grubhub, the Grubbin, Lenny, the Ladybug, and Harry, the Caterpie. Uh, Riding high, uh, nothing uh, can uh, stop uh, this the unstoppable force. Apparently my Galarian champion credits didn't transfer because before I could even start my journey, mm. I had to go to trainer school first. Mm. It was so insulting. Like, do you even know who I am? And don't you dare say James. So I beat four trainers. Yeah. Uh, I get it. The floor with yeah, this they look the same, but he's more blocky. The, classroom. the teacher just standing there like, yeah, this is Grubbin? But Top tier, leave, had Grubbin on my squad. Calls me to her office. When I first play Sun and Moon. Come on in. I hear you've been picking on little children and mm. their Pokemon. Emily? What Emily. are you doing here? Yeah. Silence, punk! Now get wrecked! She challenges me to a Pokemon battle using yeah. only one Pokemon. Except this one Pokemon was like the worst matchup possible. A Litten. Never Not mind. Not only was the Litten strong against Dupal, but yes! also against every single Pokemon. member of my team. It was an absolute bloodbath. It and was. All that was left was the smell of charred bugs uh, and barbecued chicken. He had to my restart. journey was over before it even began. At a school, my self-esteem mm -mm -mm. was shot. Like not I've even one trial so in. Much, That's crazy. And I fought so many tougher foes. This is why you pick Litten. Defeated by a total scrub. Is this what it's like to be Ash Ketchum? There you have it, everyone. No. That was my uh, long overdue Pokemon Ultra Moon Nuzlocke. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment. That's great. Wow, what an amazing so video. He's won Best one. video of the year, honestly. Buy that merch. Roll the credits. I and will I'll see you in another three months. All right, reaction over. Let's get it. Now I'm just kidding. Obviously, it's long. It's thirty minutes. Don't say anything. Come on, popsicle. I actually wanted you the entire time. What? Anyway, so Garbage. Actually, welcome to okay. My blind Pokemon. All right, I'ma dislike this. I'm on Ultra Sun Nuzlocke. I hope Moon it dies. Nuzlocke, never heard of it. A lot has happened already, so let me get you up to speed. I got a brand new dream team: Popsicle the Poplio, Dubba, Precious the Caterpie, and Doordash the Grubbin. I met Professor Kakui, who signed me up to take part in the trial Disappointed. challenge. Disappointed. How can you choose Poplio? It's literally the worst uh, Gen 7. It's okay, worst well, starter overall. Collapsed, and then we ended up being it's even worse than Meganium. Guardian Pokemon, and it gave me a Z and powering, Chestnut. So that and that's hard cool. to beat. I met my rival. He already had a name, but from now on, How? we're just going to call him Jagger Jim Bob Jow. Because no. it's cooler. And we're going to be great rivals until the end of time. But I crushed him in our first battle. Yeah, obviously. beat the Pichu, and beat I the Rowlet. I finally get my revenge on Emily, which brings us to full circle. So, uh, yeah. Pretty eventful first day, if you ask me. We can have the stone. Very simple. And first trial on our list was Totem Yes, Gum Shoes. DoorDash smacked him with a bunch of mud slaps, so he couldn't hit us at all. Precious Bro, I missed Totem Pokemon. And then Dubby punched him in his... The total theme? Slap. Though, so, uh, 
Dubby, we gotta work out more. But first trial is complete nonetheless. Professor Kakui meets me outside to show me how to use the Z crystal ring, but yes. not that this one is of many any people. Use to a lot of people hate the Z crystal. I thought to it was dope. I bought the Z ring, so it was up to I me thought it was to go cool. find I her. I hit that dance free. every time. We eventually do find her in the meadow, but Nebby just keeps I love running Gen away 7. from Gen us. Gen and when we do catch up to it, I'm challenged to a battle by this futuristic yes. robot guy named Dulce, who's a member of the Ultra Recon Squad. It's Dulce. Well, e his right there, foul looks it. like it could use a real super effective punch to the face. Do it, Dubby. Yeah, fur coat. Get Dubby. out of here. And thus, the first blood of the Nuzlocke. Pushing mm -hmm. forward, you ran into none other than Jagger Jim Bob Jow. He too finishes trial well, well, and fell oh, like he It's not the action on, recon. You know what? Is it I just, just a recon squad? Dubby, and I just wasn't in the mood, so I showed him no mercy. Let's keep Whatever, this cool. thirst I kind of wish they had that in more of story. Hala is it 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 my it. guy, bro. All of his Hala Pokemon were fighting types, so, you know, no real concern with Precious and Wumpus yeah, taking the lead. I actually had no idea that fairy types were super effective against fighting types, so, you know, it's just another one of those fairy matchups that makes no sense. He's doing another buzz Victory was about in that. hand, then the next island of Akala yeah. waits. Hey, hey, is that like that's in Gen 6, bro? Sightseeing, shopping, no, you poke charts. And then Garbage over Pokemon. To Town where I square off once again against my rival, old Jim Bob here. And like he has some the Pikachu Western. this time. <laughs> too slow. Touch so I passed cool. out from drinking too much Moo Moo milk, and when I woke up, I found this fun little bunch known as Gladion. King Skull and Gladion, who challenges me to a fight. In it's Gladion. Whatever. Team Skull is the best team ever. Yeah, take it down. Double up, double up. Take it down. Yeah. Team Skull, Team Skull. Team Skull was epic. I wanted more. Give me too much trouble. Guzma so was good. cool. And look at that. It's already time it's for boy. my second trial at Brooklet Hill. Yep, the Arachnid. Uh -huh. That is one big water spider. And mm -hmm. regular Sunny Moon is a wishy washy. Because the Arachnid had a weather boosted bubble beam and a roar. And beam. the like, water, bu the water bubble happen? ability. Also, I forgot to mention that in addition to the powerful giant monster you're fighting, you also have to take Not on its only force. The water bubble because gives apparently it more on this island, 2v1 water, is considered stab fair. Water, more so power. Sucks, it's also in the, so the rain. So the rain makes it more powerful. So that way I can heal up DoorDash again. I made the switch. Finished Raquanid off. Insane to think that we actually survived that unscathed, but now I have Mr. Munchie. Yep. And thank goodness, too, because the next trial was on a volcano with a Oh, I love this trial. Mallet. It was fun. Good job, guys. But oh my gosh. Oh, you got a Raquanid. trial with Durantis. That Easy was like dub. super annoying. It was supposed to be a simple bug to grass matchup. Yes. But all this bug imposter did was heal itself nonstop with its ally, who, guess what? Also healed. If you had a lid, it, it wouldn't be a problem. Later. We do beat it, and I found a pincer. I named hey. stuff. What's behind that rock? I'm not really sure, but I'm probably gonna come back here. Hello? Is he a crystal? Oh, hey, Professor. Possibly. I don't remember. There's it's a been giant so long. wormhole that just opened up. Yeah. Oh, you mean the large crack in the sky? Yeah, I see that. Plumeria. Oh, I'm gonna have to call you back. I think some pigtail lady wants to fight me. Yes. Okay, anyways, with that taken care of, it was time for Bro. the second grand trial. Haha, <laughs> Olivia? Uh, she could get it. <laughs> Kahuna Olivia. She uses rock type Pokemon, yep. which, you know, are usually Super pretty strong effective. against bugs. Well, you Unless the bugs type. attack first and no water and grass moves, which I did. That said, her Lilip became way too strong by stacking up some ancient power boosts. Basically, it put Whoa. my entire team in a bad spot. I didn't think it was that fast yet, so I sent in Wumples to quickly finish it We're off. But, oh, I was wrong. He couldn't take another hit, and the Lily will for sure attack. That's scary. First. But I had to take this opportunity, so I am to sorry. Heal it off. But his sacrifice opened a path to victory. Pinsir's epic. Not long after a lot of mourning the loss of another fallen teammate, I received Pokemon. an invitation from a mysterious bug-looking man to come to a special island. So I hop on a ferry and I travel to Ether Paradise, which is actually not an island, but just a I large floaty thing. There we meet yeah. President Lumine. It's a man-made <laughs> resort. I listen to her spiel laboratory. about building the island to be a safe haven. Lumine can get it too. All Pokemon. And then this giant alien jellyfish yep. just yep. randomly he appears. Let go. And of all people, I have to fight it. I don't even know what is good against this thing. So, uh, everyone attack! <laughs> it's a rock well, poison. Worked. Answer me, you stupid jellyfish. Where's your bug friend? Who sent you? It didn't answer me, but we True. did later learn about a Pokemon called Necrozma, Necrozma, who is evil and wants to consume Steals all light, the light on this planet. But who cares about that? Because it's on to the next island and my fourth trial. 
Yeah. Let me tell you, that one Third sucked. island. Even more than the last one. This spiky puffball kept protecting so himself with bounces and spiky shields while his buddy Skarmory spammed spikes and torment. The mm -hmm. only super effective moves I had was Stud's Brick Break, but he could probably get one shot by a bounce and DoorDash's his Dig, which fortunately mm -hmm. is just not that great to begin with. DoorDash would use the Dig, but then about the Charge would use like, Bounce, would the Dig misses, Skarmory. Skarmory would then use Torment, so I can't use Dig again, and oh look, there goes a chunk of DoorDash's health. You guys suck! Mr. In order Munchie to evolve into the tankiest a, uh, member I had, so he chipped away at the health bar as bolt. best as he could, and, and you he need was to able to protect island, against some of the bounces, but which unfortunately, sucks. it's he a late game on getting critted. Precious came out on the spiky oh, and butterfly. sustained heavy damage, but in her last moments, she managed to put the Togedemaru to sleep, ultimately okay, giving squad. DoorDash the opportunity we needed and squad landed effective. the final blow. We completed w, the bug. ridiculous trial but at a heavy cost. This island is awful. You know, this was supposed to be a chill and relaxing Don't thing, worry, you still have the ghost and an dark. island of death and anguish. Precious and Mr. Munchie. No! And okay, the Guzma well, fight. after that fiasco, I had to really rethink my approach to this whole challenge. I have lost way too many good Pokemon, and I'm barely, like, halfway through my trials. Yep. My current reserve of usable Pokemon was, uh... Yeah, not so Galissa great. So I have to take some Galissa time to do a Pot. bit more research Galissa on the Pot. island and uh, see what Pot. I might have missed. And hopefully, I can bolster the team. <laughs> I evolved a Pinaco and a Gumball and revived a Claw Fossil to get Spike the Anorith. And it save you for later. I was like, we could revive fossils. That's in the second island. And meet Guzma, a Guzma! bug fanatic trainer. Guzma. It is we can Guzma. totally be best friends, but yes. unfortunately, yes. he's also Team Skull's leader. Yes. And, uh, yeah, me and Team Skull His aren't on the best of terms. Fire. Professor Gakui is also there the for rival. some reason, and he the just rivals. tells Guzma straight up that I'm better than him. Yeah. I mean, hey. <laughs> So understandably, Guzma disagreed, and he challenged me to a battle. This Dude, island isn't is big enough for two bug lovers. Bring it, bug eyes! Guzma's infamous Galissapod yes, first, but my gumball is a super tank, so his Galissapod couldn't do anything to him. Oh, your sucker punch your defense. failed. Perfect. Oh, what a sucker. Physical wall. His masquerade, though, was actually a lot stronger than I yeah. thought. Almost knocked Gumball out. But thank goodness for Popsicle. After that, I took a Let's go. tour on Route Wimp 8 Pod. to pick up Tanjiro, the Wimp Pod. And on our way to our next trial, DoorDash finally evolves into a Vika Volt at a power plant. Protect was that in Third it. Island? What? In Tabu I Village, we went to meet the next captain I'm at crazy. the Ether's house, but... Sick of you goose. What? The oh, captain yeah, named Acerola returns, and then she sends me over to an abandoned Acerola. superstore for the next trial against Mimikyu. The Mimikyu. This was an interesting fight because I had no idea what was super Bro, I love the way Mimikyu, that he does the totem Pokemon. Gumball. I like taking everything, chipped away at the Mimikyu the, and Dorda highlights, but like and delivered the extra the markings on it. To I got a delivery totem. for a thunderbolt to the base. The trial. We come back to the either house Fun and fact, I find out uh, the team Mimikyu skull kidnapped especially Yungus, bulky. and that if I wanted it back, so it would have hit it, it would have taken it probably like two thunderbolts to do that. Boss. Why they would take some child's Yungus is beyond me. Like, look, I don't know. They're it's team skull. Right they're petty. En route to Po Town on Route 16, I caught a Rabombi and named it Pollen. Now, before uh, any of you start writing in the comments, doops. whoa, John, that's cheating because you already got one, man. Hey, you, if he wants it, he can get it. I caught its pre evolution, all right? So while I can't catch another cutie fly, I can catch its evolution because I haven't done that yet. So shut up. Anyways, okay. outside of oh. Poe Town, there is. So he's not doing species clause, okay? Because species clause, you will be able, if you catch a prevo, then if, if for some reason the lair, not for some reason, if you so it happens to encounter the evolution of a prevo you caught, you can, you know, you could just skip it because, you know, you already have the Pokemon that can evolve into it, so there's no point of catching it and pot end up with two in the box species clause i'm get, i mean species and dupes the thing is like you could play if, like dupes could be applied but if you want that same pokemon that you really have you could get it again for example let's say i have a scrafty i lost a scrafty then i counter a scrafty but i really want it even though i could re-roll for another one you could uh, i could catch it because is this mysterious know. guy named Nani. He's he tells me not to go inside but i ignore him Team Nanu. Nanu is that everywhere. guy but my love pokemon Nanu. are too strong for them and they can't do anything about it we eventually reach guzma once again and just like our last the encounter, chest of... stud and doordash easily took out guzma's pokemon the chest but of this a... time it was Bug his versus my 
Tanji. Yes. What a fierce rival. Garbage name, but whatever. That I'll win. Guzma is defeated, yep. and I take back the Yungus. When I get Youngus. back to the Ether's house, however, I find out that my entire journey was just a distraction so that Team Skull could come back and kidnap Lily and Lily Nebby. And Nebby. You didn't protect the Nebby! Guess we gotta go get yeah. him back. Gladion has a feeling kid. that Lily was taken to Ether Island, so Gladion, Jagger, Aether. Jim Bob Jow, and I took a ferry to get there. Before we could leave, Nanu appears. And Bro, this guy does not like how, because he didn't even Kahuna. drew him as a house. Nanu, more like Nani. Okay, yeah, that's a nope. We yeah. have a grand trial right then and there, but you know, Bug Kaku versus rah. Dark, it's just not really Sibilai. a competition. Uh, but hey, it did get uh, yeah. to bring yeah, out Bug Spike Mars. for the first time, so that was pretty cool. Send these dark Pokemon back to the abyss. Now we're oh. off to save Lily and Nebby. Ah, uh, garbage Primarina. If get you out here. See Die already. Resident, you'll have to get through all of us. Okay. I don't remember, does Papa even have a fly gun? No, we can't let Point you ball. stop Lusa me. You are too late. With Nebby's powers, we will be able to open up a portal Warhol, to another yep. dimension where Necrozma is waiting. There, Guzma and I will defeat it, and I will save all my precious Pokemon. All right, jump but in. I'm sure you have many questions as to how Gladion and Lily are tied into all of this. For They're I my am children. Other than their their mom. mother. I mean, I didn't want to assume, but yeah, it was pretty obvious. There were the she only three blonde on people. What is the fourth off one? If I were to beat her in a Pokemon battle. But that person also tied so an end to them. But then she goes, Psych! Uses Nebby's powers and her Sayonara, along with Guzma later. jump into a portal. Leaving hey, but Nebby Guzma's a rider in the shape of a stone. They are most likely he jumped in. way over No hesitation. Head, so we figured it's a good idea to go after them. And in order to do so, we need a legendary Pokemon that can so transport Galeo. us across so the Galeo. And apparently they can only be summoned by two flutes the moon and sun flute gladion already has one and the other one is on pony island we have our head we arrive at seafolk village and are yep. greeted by Captain on the Nina, executor who then us to talk to a girl island, whatever Hapu. hopefully this is the person that can help us so locate the island's kahuna who can then tell us more about this legendary pokemon Mudsdale. that we know little to nothing about the world hangs in the balance yeah we don't have a kahuna here nah oh what well yeah, that, that, threw, that threw me off for a loop. Oh, hey, speaking of ruining your hope, meet me later at the Ruins of Hope. So that just happened. Her grandmother showed up later and showed us how to move giant boulders. Now that's yeah. for a moment to go get Mo something. Champ. And then we headed over to the ruins. While the there, we witnessed oh, Hapu receiving a blessing from the island's guardian, and she became the brand the, new Kahuna, Kahuna of Pony Island. Yep, and because Lele. she's Kahuna, now no, sorry, not she's Lele. allowed was, to tell spinning. us that the flute we need is on Executor Island. Was all of this necessary? I don't know, but we have our heading. We mm -hmm. arrive on Executor Island and, uh, ooh, what a sight. We save yep, the yep. old and executors by removing the pincers that are stuck on their head. I mm -hmm. caught Atropius because they are awesome and shut up. It's not like I'm going to be using it anyway. The sun flute is ours. Back on Pony Island oh, in the you didn't talk about the Pony Lily Canyon, moment. That's there sad. is a shrine that we're supposed to play the flutes at. Yep, Blocking yep. the entrance, Como Dulce of Como the Ultra o. Recon Squad tries to stop me once again. I am Ultra much recon. better than That's I was, what it was before. It was an action and recon. Maybe I can even take on Necrozma myself. Now watch my amazing powers. Pipe Hall. Use nasty Purple. plot. Yeah, okay. Lily and I pressed on, and the only thing now standing in my way was a giant Como and a Noi Burn. Oh, because my oh. next trial just happened to be on the way. <laughs> Looking yep, at the, the situation and common trends of this like person island bro, challenge, on, was, even though was Pollen so cool. was strong against both, I had a pretty good feeling that Como or the Noi Burn had something that could one shot Pollen, so I resorted to the best strategy I knew how by having Gumball use Toxic and stall until Como died. Not the most Damn. dignified strategy I've done, but uh, That's crazy. Hey, easily got the comma out of the way. I would have fought back. <laughs> fight to finish off the Noivern. And bestowing upon us the, the Dragon, Dragon Zine Zine. Crystal, which is useless to me. We climb an absurd of amount of useless. stairs, oh, and with whatever air dragon. we have left in our it. lungs, we played the flutes. The music awakens <laughs> Nebby, and it evolves yep. into a giant lion-looking so Pokemon. Turns out that this was the Pokemon that can transport us across dimensions, uh -huh. and it was with us the entire time. And just as we were about to leave... They jump out. So how'd it go? <laughs> Run! That thing is a monster! 
Whoa. Yeah. yeah. I thought Eternatus looked weird. In and its the newest battle. shiny form, Nebi and Necrozma duke it out. He fought bravely, but Necrozma was, was stronger. Strong. And eventually, Bro, Necrozma prevailed, allowing it to absorb the and fuse into Nebi. With that yep. done, more portals opened up in the sky, and these weird Ultra Pokemon come out yeah. of them, including the one that I have been searching for. Ah, finally. Okay, but it looks like I got to deal with this Aslan imposter first. Once again, I am put in that classic Dust situation man. where I Bro, don't know what's the thing. Dust was thing, so much better but than. Regardless, uh, faithful and reliable Dawn Tanjiro man. was able to land right, some good the other one hits. Name? Good thing Whatever. I taught Tanjiro bulldoze because that was perfect, and it took Necrozma out. Defeated, Necrozma retreats through a wormhole, leaving the island mm -hmm. enshrouded in darkness. Okay, but not exactly like the darkest day. It's more like the second darkest day. You have to go <laughs> after it here. Take a ride on our Lunala. It will allow you to travel through dimensions as well. Yep, there's Defeat multiple the nebbies. Cosma. Save the world. Riding on top of the Lunala, I am transported to Ultra Metropolis, Dulce's yeah. home planet, where Necrozma well, yeah. is waiting on the top Bro. of a tower. Oh, it man. is there that I am met with the biggest. There was such a missed opportunity for U Ultra Metropolis. Bro, like this, this whole play area could have been something epic. Like, oh, I wish they'd done something with this. I mean, we did have the ultra battle there, but I wish there was more to it. It's challenge yet. More stairs. I managed yeah. to climb to the top Bro, of the tower. Bro, the walk up to it was out crazy. Of shape and out of breath, but still it wasn't ready crazy. to it just like Necrozma once and for all. Like, you but when the I first, reached like, him, dunk, oh, he dunk, wasn't done. Dunk, the Necrozma used the rest of its power transform. to transform into its final form. His ultra form. Yeah. Okay, well, you may be bigger, more shiny, but Tanjiro beat you once, he'll beat yep. you again. First impression. 60? Impossible. In the blink of an eye, my entire team was obliterated. And just like that, really? my entire journey was over. But you know what? I feel like I deserve a pass on this one. No, you don't. There's no way that I could have known that that thing was going to be this strong, let alone adequately prepare for it. None of us knew it was going to be that strong. But hey, I still pulled through. I still won. Like, bruh, this is real life, man. Bruh. I don't have a device that lets me see into the future. I'm just saying this whole thing was kind of rigged. So here's what nah. happened. In fairness, I was given a second chance. However, I would need one, to make three. a sacrifice of one of one, my own three. Pokemon. And unfortunately, I had to pick Pollen. But who knows? Maybe it was better this way. Bro, so, if he thank used you, first Pollen, impression, for everything that you would have been good. And with that sacrifice, my team was revived, and this time we defeated Ultra Necrozma by toxic stalling again. Yes, I know, I know. I'm not proud of it either. Jeez. Mm -mm, mm -mm, Yet another mm -mm. chance at life only to use a super cheesy strategy to beat a big bad boss. It's not the most satisfying feeling in the world. I'm pretty sure my Cinder was of. the one that beat the Ultra Necrozma. I'm pretty sure potions, it was. Power of friendship and oh, thank goodness Gumball knows sturdy. Necrozma goes down and we save the world once again. But holy crap, that was rough. You're back. I see Bro, that using the your theme, mastery of the, the Z Ultra crystals, you were able too. to save the world. Such a cool battle. Oh yeah, I, I wish it was more to I it. had those. But I mean, it's not like I would have been able to use them anyway. Do you want then this white ball? Yes. No. no. Yeah. Do you want beast balls? Yes. Well, <laughs> actually, I have beast balls. I mean, yes, thank you. Let's see, where did we leave off? Ubi ah, too. yes, my final trial. Reinvigorated with life, yep, my yep. Pokemon and I the headed back to trial. Seafolk Village to challenge Captain Mina. But considering Mina. the fact that I just fought a giant doom dragon, going up against her team of fairy Pokemon was just not nearly as challenging. My team the handled it very easy. You think bugs, I'm done, so right? But unfortunately, you know, no. Because apparently, have. that was only the first half of the trial. Now yep. I need to go battle all the other captains that I met along the way and get Soccer, pedals please. from them. <laughs> and then I can battle the final totem Pokemon. Yep. So, to speed totem. things up, give me all your pedals. Finally, so I fact, brought all of the pedals back. There was no fair trial into a in the regular flower. sun and moon. Ooh, I wonder why they didn't And then do they that. attracted the totem Rabombi. Pollen? Is that you? And with that, we obtain the Fairy Z Crystal. And yeah. finally, yes, finally, it is time for the grand trial on Executor Island where Kahuna Hapu is waiting for us. Mm -hmm. Her ground Pokemon were strong. Liquidation! Tanjiro was just stronger. 
We are one step closer to our objective. But before challenging the Elite Four, it was time to do what I came here for. Bug hunting. Heck yes. Yep, get the Ultra. Mm, I don't think this is the right place. Nope. <gasps> Ooh, that yeah. would be very tempting. In but Insect no. Queen! Okay, Garantina. well this place is just weird. So no. Nope. Nope. Kirby. Nope. Nope. Ant nope. Bugs nope. Life. Eh. Nope. Get Boba's me out of here. Oh my gosh. What just happened to me? That's I cool. Me. I like oh, that. That was creative. That, that was, was creative. Props. <gasps> I think we're here. Yep. I don't think I, I the ever used we've the all been training the for is here. We Usan. have lost a lot of good members to bring us to where we are now, but Buzz all swap, we can do swap, is Buzz make swap, them proud Buzz by what swap. we do next. Some of you haven't been with us long, but in this short time, you have already convinced me that this is a team of champions. Now let's do this and get off this cursed island. Next round of Molasadas are get on Get ready, Primarina, please, First of please I beg you. was Malain and a team yep, full steel. of steel-type Pokemon. Now, fire the only problem was absolutely will be the flying. Here, but for the longest time, I just didn't have one. Until the flying now, will be the, will be the enter problem. Solar, the Volcarona. Yeah. Let me tell you, she was just a true powerhouse. Those steel type Pokemon didn't stand. They really needed that. Olivia was the next Elite Four member, and she rock. came back with vengeance with her rock Pokemon, specifically mm -hmm. her Cradle. But say hello to my second newest member, yes. Escanor, the Buzzwool. Buzzwool, Buzzwool. Crush me? Who decided that? Now. You know what he's saying? Uh, no, don't chuck Fortress! Acerola was the next Ace member Rola? with yep. ghost Pokemon. Mm -hmm. And technically, I didn't have anyone that was super effective against her Pokemon. But when in doubt, just hit them really hard. And Solar once again came out and stacked with a Quiver I'm Dance and sent is those ghost dark? Pokemon I'm back a low to the kick, Shadow this is Gen 7. And you know what that is? It's the smell of fish. Bug ghost? Shut in. my Pokemon. We were just chilling. And now we are already at the final Elite Four yep, member. Flying. And her flying Pokemon. Finally, something for the rest of the team to do. So Rock, after a tough steel, battle electric, with all of her flying Pokemon good. and a quick chat with Kahili Neutral. that badminton is probably and better, all effective. that was left was the champion. Except wait, this league doesn't have a champion yet. When I reached the top of the mountain, Professor Kakui mm -hmm. was there to greet me. As the man that set up Alola's first Pokemon League, he wanted to witness and crown the very first yep, champion he wants to watch of it. the Alolan region. And who could have guessed that the, the first final two battle, trainers. the one to decide it all, would be between me and none other than wow. my rival, Jagger Jim Bob Jow. And I wouldn't have it any other way. You beat him. Hey, hey, hey. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, hey. Go, right you. In regular Sun and Moon, you fight against uh, Kukui. And because of that, many people think Kukui is the first the champion. He's not. You are the first champion. He's pretty much like, hey, if you want to be the champion, you have to beat me. Hey, hey. I forgot he has an over. It's been so long since I flew some. Air Slash! Bro, Bosa. You better knock some sense into this crap abominable. There we go. Flex! Mm hmm. And Sarah. The only one that can really be in Center War is Galissapod and Buzzwool, just the fighting in the water. Liquidation! Hey, hey, hey. Bro, two of my favorite Gen 7 monster duking it out. That's crazy! Oh! 
he's gonna hit it with the Warrior MZ. Did a stupid demon slayer move. Of course he is. Ah, wait, hold up. There's still. Does that make it uh one three for him? One three? Cause he lost he tried the moon, lost, and lost twice in sun. Right? Did he lose twice in sun? I lost count. But yes. I will say this doesn't count. Mm -mm -mm. Doesn't count. There's no redos. No redos. No redos. No redos. Doesn't count. But anyways, obviously. Pretty fun. I think I like the first Nuzlocke video more than this one. Probably because he chose Pimarina, that's why. <laughs> Anyways, uh, the link to the original video down in the description below. Obviously, you can watch it, so go like it, so support uh, Young Young Tales. Oh my god, I almost said the right name wrong. And support me by liking and subscribing to me. See y'all in the next reaction, okay? Bye bye